Hello there, Scoffert here. This is an update for my vanilla challenge, building a custom map in survival. And uh, I just uh, recorded one uh, episode in Swedish and I ended up here in my jungle. And over there I have my dark oak. It's uh, 4,000 blocks of something away. So I traveled back. I I took uh, um, a boat and so to get here. But to get back I uh, opened a portal and I started to searching my way, way back. And uh, I think here is my coordinates if you want to know them. I think I will run back to my place. And I uh, came across a fortress. A fort? What is it called? Uh, oh, follow the cobble. Uh, on my way here, or there, or how it was. Maybe I found it before. But that doesn't matter. So I will. You can follow my trip here. Uh, I don't think it's so very long. So I will run as fast as okay. I can. I have a. I took a potion, a speed potion, and that's why I run a little bit faster. That's. Oh, I have some unharvested clothes on here. Uh, let's, let's see. That's my fortune. Because I want to know, you know if it works on 11. That's less than 4 a piece. No, then I won't use uh, that one for, for close stuff. That's a waste of enchants. Uh, if you know if it um, should uh, work on glowstone, then you can tell me in the comments, please. And uh, that's... Where did I go? Oh, should I follow the cobble now or the torches? I don't remember. Maybe I switched to torches. Yes, here. Because I made another way here. And up here, and then there's a small path to the fortress. And if you don't know where it is and want to know, here's the coordinates. And I just run straight through it. I have searched a little found some nether woods and places and so on. That's why I have this uh, maze thing, because of the blazes. And here is the um, way out. Entrance and way out. That's another word for it. I know, but I can't. The exit. <laughs> So easy, so easy. Yeah. And downstairs here is my uh, portal. And uh, first I ran here and here and uh, there and out here and searched for the fortress. Then I, this way it goes to it. But this is the more straight ahead way. Go there. Uh, I'm still stuttering. Here, now, uh, the, here's what, uh, where I have my portal. I don't think I had it in the last episode, but it's uh, near my uh, uh, machine, where I put logs up there. That makes um, charcoal, and I'm 
not all out of charcoal, but uh, yeah. and here is where I put my other things: stone or cobblestone here to make stone. Oh, I could sort this out. Yeah. And here is my new uh, uh, storage. Uh, but it was it's a bit narrow here so i'm going to extend it out there and uh, make it more spacey or what do you say that's a straight translation from swedish rymlig and rymd is space so spacey yep that works for me uh and I have emptied my chests down there. And up here, some changes. Yeah, I started this in the last episode. Let's see if they... Oh, a bit food there. And up here, it's night, of course. So I'll sleep first. And then I'll show you what I have happened here. I have organized my sheep farm, so I have one stable or one, what's it called? Space for every color of sheep. And here is a sheep that has escaped, or maybe they bred, breed, bred, yeah, breeded across the fence, but oh, no, no, that's not okay. The brown from Coco, and that was the last found, last one I made because uh, that was four thousand blocks away. Here is my is it cyan? Uh, I don't have any shears Be because uh, not because uh, when I came here yesterday there was a hole here. I don't know if I opened it or if. Someone else open it. I don't have any one on the server, but you never know. Herobin maybe. Uh, so all those ships was down in a cave uh, down here, and I have to lure them up again. And uh, my cocoa farm, my wheat farm, my weed farm, my or is it called? Uh, yes, it's a reed, yeah, and uh, cacti farm, my chicken farm, some eggs, oh, tree farm, carrot farm, horse, not farm, potatoes, potatoes, and potatoes, and trees, and potatoes, uh, no. I forgot, I emptied this in the last episode, in the Swedish one. I have uh, made an automatic harvesting. So when I push that button, the water starts to flow. And when all the, uh, in this case, potatoes have uh, uh, floated down here, I have to put it out and then it stops. And then I have to uh, manually put them into the ground again. Down here is where uh, the magic happens. Now, uh, the redstone signal is uh, directed here. So this torch makes a redstone signal that locks this um, repeater and when I push the button, it opens for just a second because this will um, uh, go off. And this, just a split second after, will uh, trigger this, and uh, then it will lock again when it's uh, and uh, yeah, then it will be on like this, and then. I turned it out. So it was a, some problem fixing it, but uh, at last I got it. So I will have to replant this. 
I think that was... No, that was not all. Uh, I have some changes at the skeleton farm. Uh, but I, uh, I'll just talk you through it. I have... Oh, this is uh, new stairs too. Um, I made uh, sh some chests and a brewing stand and a melon farm. No, not melon. Uh, pumpkin farm. And um, what was it more? Um, let's see. Which direction was it? Uh, I forgot where it is. Uh, I have always run underground. Uh, I think it was this way. And. Uh, yeah, so it's not so much changes there, so it's not worth the time running there. But I have some idea for a um, story now. I won't tell you yet, but um, it will be um, more of an adventure uh, problem solver thing. Um, not any questions or uh, you know what um, different types of the things you can have i think maybe i can tell you that you will uh, it's probably a rescue mission yeah something like that but the theme exactly i won't tell you yet and yeah, that's all for now. So I thank you for watching. Oh, here now <laughs> I'm here. Uh, so I just run down and show you the small changes I've done here. It's my pumpkin farm, my enchanting room, my brewing stand. I think I'm going to collect some more blaze rods and make an uh, triple brew stand so I can make the first step because I, I take three bottles and I take one of those and then I can f start with uh, putting in Nerdwort in the top one and then move them down one step and uh, start a new one with Nerdwort and uh, put the glistering melon in the next and so on so it will be a little more uh, ongoing all the time, not so much waiting. Uh, but I don't have to use so many. If, mm, maybe it's not worth uh, worth it. But yeah. we'll see. And uh, then uh, I have the chest room here. It's not so big, but I have collected a few stuff. There. And here, yeah. So I'll just stand here AFK for a while now and uh, I have to get up some levels because I found several diamonds. I didn't show any of the chests uh, in the other room, but when I have extended it and uh, I will show you in another episode. So now, thanks for watching and um, see you another time. Bye!